Uh, in March, President Nazarbayev and President Obama, they uh, met on the fringes, uh, fringe, uh, fringes of Kimla Security Summit in The Hague. And once again, we affirmed their commitment to non-proliferation and strengthening nuclear security in the Asia Pacific Basin. Um, last week, uh, it was another uh, important event. Uh, five nuclear weapon states, China, France, Russia, United Kingdom, and United States, together with five Central Asian countries, uh, you know, it's uh, Kazakhstan, Kyrgyzstan, Tajikistan, Turkmenistan, and Uzbekistan, they get together in the UN and sign the protocol to uh, uh, the Central Asian Nuclear Weapon Free Zone. You know, we created this nuclear free weapon zone in Central Asia, once again, to show the world that we are non-nuclear states and we do not allow, produce, trans transit, or uh, buy the nuclear weapons uh, which could be stationed on, on, on that territory. Uh, it was signed uh, actually in September 2006 in San Nicolás, the place where we had nuclear testing, which was kind of a symbolic uh, gesture to that, uh, by all the Central Asian, five Central Asian countries. And, uh, you know, in 2009, it actually was recognized in the UN, but P5 were not uh, kind of committed to work with us on this zone because they thought that there are some uh, provisions in this document which do not allow them to be fully sure that this zone could be uh, nuclear free. So Kazakhstan, when we became chair of this uh, five countries, uh, we started active work with uh, the P5 uh, on behalf of Central Asian neighbors, and just last week at the UN, uh, this protocol was signed. Now the remaining part is to ratify it, and then uh, it, this zone will become a legal framework uh, for recognizing this zone. So I think that it's a significant achievement of our multilateral diplomacy. And it shows again that Kazakhstan can inspire uh, our partners in the region and around the world to make a difference, to galvanize the global community to make something uh, important. And you know, uh, we also, I just finished with saying that uh, on this part, it's, uh, you know, we, we play a prominent role in uh, you know this Iranian nuclear program. We hope that uh, soon, rounds of negotiations among Iran and the P5 plus one group. And I just like to quote what President Obama wrote in a letter to our president on the occasion of Kazakhstan's Independence Day last year, saying that uh, Kazakhstan was still making progress on, uh, on the international community's concern with Iran's nuclear program. Because that two rounds came forward, opened the way for the Talks, which were, we think, successful, and uh, they, I think we continue, if we continue this way, we probably will go. Um, you know, I think that for the country, for any country to progress uh, in the future, what is important is to have uh, a young generation of leaders who think 